What's up, Ant City, and welcome back to another episode of Demon Slayer, the Hinokami Chronicles. And as you can see, we're starting on the title screen today, which I don't I think we've only ever done that on my first ever video. Because there as at the time of me recording this, which should be literally the night before you're seeing this, a new update just dropped for Demon Slayer Hinokami Chronicles. So Let's just hop straight into it. Also, if you can't tell by my mic quality, I don't know if it's that vastly different, but I do have a new mic, which I've used for one other video, which was that video about Dragon Ball Breakers, the I titled it Future of Dra the Future of Dragon Ball Games. So yeah, got a new mic. Uh, I don't know if you can really tell from this, but anyways, though, point is we're hopping in to look at the new update. So let's start the game up right now. Check it for add-ons. And yeah, look, here we go. So we got Yahaba in the game, which is the arrow demon. And then we also have Tomaru, the, you know, I call it the, well, I say volleyball demon. That's what I call her. So we got that. And yeah, it's just letting you know she, he launches arrows. They don't damage themselves. They can stagger. Okay. You can just pause if you want to read that. But this is another reason why we're playing this today. So. Uh, the reason why, like, today, if you noticed in the title and everything, we're not doing online battles today, actually, because there is a 60 frames per second mode now, so I want to see how buttery smooth that's going to look, but the problem is, to play in 60 frames, you have to be offline, so it says, uh, the game, it says online matches as well as cutscenes and all that stuff will always run at 30 frames, so we have to do offline matches to show the 60 frames unfortunately so we're just gonna do an offline battle i'm not gonna show off the demons in this video though like i know that it kind of it's kind of a tease i just showed them but this video is mostly just focusing on that 60 frames so we're gonna head into the settings really quick and yeah it's new fighters but don't worry the next two videos of demon slayer you're getting will be those new demons i promise <laughs> but this video i wanted to focus on the actual 60 frames that just dropped and kind of just have a look at it so we got the kimono yeah, Arrow Tamari Demon. Tamari Demon, that's what it's called. Okay. You can now play the game at 60 frames. So, yeah, let's head up the options. It should be, let's see. Oh, frame rate right here. So, we're going to up. Oh, wait. It says it can only be changed from the title screen. Okay, so let's go back. Go to options. Frame rate. If you change the game around one more smoothly. Online match. Yeah, okay. Basically, what it said before. We're going straight to 60 frames per second. So. Yep, so now, the game. oh, you can already tell, actually. Look at how much smoother it's, like, running so far. Well, you'll see it more in the battle, but, yeah, but unfortunately, online battles are not in 60 frames. But uh, you can kind of tell already that it's running silky smooth. Oh, my God. But let's go ahead and just head into some offline matches. I'm just going to use my normal, typical team, which is, you know, we're going to just fight the CPU because I don't have anyone in person to play with. Uh, we'll just do normal, and then... We're just going to play as my, you know, Zenitsu and Rengoku. I do need to practice anyways. And yeah, you have Yahaba and Tomaru, which, you know, like I said, I'm not going to play as them quite yet. But, yeah, oh, I could play Akaza in 60. But you know what? We might do, t I might do my second round with Akaza in this video. But we're going to start playing as, uh, you know, Zenitsu, Rengoku, the classic team. Look at how smooth, like, the character movements are already. But we're going to see it more in action. That's what we're really here for, seeing it in play. So, yeah. Um, so yeah, we got them. Let's just do two randoms. Oh, we got Rui. Okay, well, I guess we're going to play Rui. Wait, actually, let me go back. I want to do different randoms. I don't want, like, a demon as a random. So let me... Let me just click Giyu and then random the other one. Okay, Giyu and Sabito. Cool. So, yeah, we're going to... These are all the maps I have. We're going to go Mugen Train. And, yeah, we're just going to go ahead and jump straight in, pretty much. So, yeah, the 60 frames mode, though. Look, oh, my God. It's... <laughs> Oh, it looks so beautiful, man. Look look at this. Oh, oh, if only this was online. Oh, please. Oh, my God. It's so smooth. And, like, remember, I'm playing on PS5, too. So, like, it's running super smooth. Like, it's ridiculous. Oh, my God. Yeah, this whole video is just going to be me, like, awing over the graphics, I swear. Oh, my gosh. Because, yeah, look. Oh, my. See, this is what the game needed. But if, if this was online, bro. Oh my god. I need this online. <laughs> they said like uh they actually people are asking about why it's not online and basically the the it was on the official Twitter. They said it's basically so the game runs smoothly for everyone online so that way it's not like 
because I guess 60 frames online might be too much for the servers or whatever to handle. I don't really know. They just said that it's not 60 frames for online because it would just to, they said to give everyone like a smooth playing experience. So, yeah, but I, oh my god, like <laughs> this alone makes me want to just do like offline battle videos, but I mean, we're going to mostly just do online battles because that's the focus here. But yeah, oh my god, oh yeah, this. This looks amazing right now, let me tell you. Oh my gosh. And yeah, you'll be able to see it in the video because I am able to capture it at 60 frames. So. Yeah, let's go over to Rangoku. Yeah, I, oh, I got to see Akaza's ult in 60 frames. And we also got to see Zenitsu's ult in 60 frames, honestly. But we'll do that in a bit. Which actually, we could ult now. I'm going to try to ult now. Get him. Let's go look at this in 60 frames. It lagged a little bit, actually. Where are the ults not in 60 frames? I don't think they are. I think the ults are actually in the normal 30 frames. That's what it seemed like, at least. Yeah, look at how much smoother this is running. I thought it was lagging, but I think the... That's interesting. So I don't think ults are actually in 60 frames. Okay. That's pretty interesting. I mean, I guess that makes some sense, but... Because they're basically, like, just cutscene files, you know? So, I don't know. But... I mean, that's kind of disappointing. I wanted to see a 60 frame smooth ult, but I mean, it's fine. The ult still looks nice. So yeah, let's charge up right now. And then jump. Ooh, okay, that did not go on. I forgot you can't like dash after a jump. That's what I was trying to do. This isn't like Storm. Like, I'm, I'm used to playing Storm. All right, there we go. We killed off Gyu. So yeah, that, that was just, you know, showcasing the 60 frames. We're gonna switch over to Akaza now because Akaza's, oh my god, oh, look at this, look at the windscreen, man, oh, yeah, S rank in 60 frames, the, the S for 60, it's like 60 frames, oh my god, anyway, we're gonna switch over to Akaza now, and then I'll meet y'all when we're starting the round again. Okay, we're back in here as Akaza, and yeah, look, look at how beautiful these <laughs> the 60 frames are. Now, I wanna, I'm gonna test out Akaza's ult, too, to see if it maybe, maybe, like, certain ults are in 60 frames, I don't know, that'd be weird. But I do want to get Akaza's ult off, too, just to see if maybe, like... Oh, my God. Nezuko's grab, though. Look at how beautiful this is. Oh, look at how smooth... And, like, I don't know. For some reason, doing combos in 60 frames is just, like, more satisfying. Like, when I get, like, combos chained... Like, moves chained together, it just feels even more like a combo. I don't know how to explain it. But, like, it somehow makes the combo feel even smoother. I need this online for real. Because, like, like I'm saying, doing the... Bro... <laughs> <laughs> playing this in 60 frames makes me want to be an offline battle too. Like, I want to start just playing this game offline. I probably won't, but like I am tempted because oh my god, this this looks beautiful. Like, I don't like it runs so good in 60 frames. Yeah, I'm I'm liking this. But I will I will say though, when I just ran in a circle with Akaza, it is a little choppy. Like, am I the only one seeing that? Like, the the frames aren't all there. It's weird. Like, he kind of looks like stop motion when he's running in a circle. But, I mean, that's just a small, like, nitpick, you know? It's not, like, a big deal. Like, at the end of the day, this still looks amazing. So, let's, let's punch in his in the face. Yeet! There we go. Look at those effects, too. Look at the big, like, wave from the blast, bro. Oh, my God. I am... Yeah, this just is beautiful. Let's get the ult. Oh, I missed. Oh, I can't be missing the ult. Come on. You got to showcase it. Do it again. There we go. Yeah, so, like, you look at Akaza's ult here, too. It looks like the ults aren't in 60 frames. They seem to be, like, the like if you notice when the, like, if you look at the transition from when I'm moving in 60 frames to when the ult starts, you can kind of see it, like, slow down. And then even, like, right when it ends, you can see it speed back up to, like, the 60 frames. I, I, obviously, that's probably not the right term, speeding up and slowing down, but that's the best way I can describe it. So, yeah, it seems like the ults aren't in 60 frames. Which is, I guess is like a little jarring. I wish they were in 60 frames. I feel like it would make it all come out better. But I don't know if they can just do that, you know? I don't really know how it all works. So I don't know if they can just put it in 60 frames, you know? But if they could, that'd be nice. But yeah, it definitely seems like that they're not. So we're going to use my domain expansion kick. Yeah, I might just do... <laughs> like, before I record the next video, I'm definitely going to just practice offline a bunch. Because it's been a minute since I played the game. I won't lie. But... Still, like, oh my god, we're running at 60 frames, though? Oh, yes. It looks so good. I'm just going to play this all the time. Oh, my gosh. But, 
yeah, that's basically it for the video, though. I just wanted to showcase. Oh, my. Oh, look at Akasa's windscreen in 60 frames. Yo. It's so good. Okay, anyways, we're going to head back to the main menu and just end off the video. So, yeah. But anyways, guys, that was it for this video. You know, not too long. You know, the normal length that we do for videos. Just showing off the new 60 frames per second mode, which, yo, it, it looks so good. Oh, my gosh. It it looks amazing. But, yeah. Anyways, though, thank you all for watching. Hope you all enjoyed. If you did, make sure you hit that like button and that subscribe button. And make sure you share this video around to your grandma, your grandpa, your manager, your coworkers, and people who might be interested in this game. Because, like... I feel like the 60 frames alone could get someone to buy this game, but it might kind of push them away if they know it's only for offline battles, unfortunately. But hopefully in the future, we can get an update that's putting this to online because, oh my God, let me like, it's a whole different experience. <laughs> it's so good in 60 frames, but yeah, we'll just have to see what they do. But like I said, I'm probably going to go play a bunch more offline just because of the frames like it the game looks so like the game is already beautiful but the 60 frames really really pushes that but like i said it is a little jarring that the ult isn't in 60 frames when you do those but you know that's it, i don't know if they can just do it that easily but either way though the fact that there's any gameplay in 60 frames like this it, it's great so i'm here for it. i love it but yeah like i said i'm gonna end this video off now just showing off the 60 frames so yeah until next time though i'll see you all later and Peace. Have a good day or night, y'all. <laughs>